What is up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the cast. And so today, this is going to be a an update video. Um, so uh, I did a few videos recently about uh, Encounter ICS, which is a Droid X ROM, um, and it was made by a guy called First Encounter over on the Roots Wiki. Now, the the video that I did, I did a how to install video and. First of all, I'd just like to say thank you to First Encounter for throwing that video up in the original post uh, on the Roots Wiki, and thanks to everybody who has been subscribing to me just through because of these videos. I've recently gotten a ton of subscribers just through that one video alone. So, thank you guys to all uh, for everybody who's been doing that. Um, and then the second video was just kind of a demo video uh, about how the ROM worked. So. Today, um, it's been a little bit of a, a little while since uh, since it's been out, uh, but Beta 3 has been released out on the Roots Wiki. Um, here is here, get rid of X Split for you. Here is the original. Here's the post um, showing you everything that you need to know. Um, they've fixed a significant amount in this release. Um, so we'll look at the bug fixes in a moment, but again, radio, speakerphone now works, MMS now works, Bluetooth, GPS, etc. All of these fantastic things work. Camera, HDMI, voice input, except for calls, and FM radio. Uh, and then just, there's just a few other things here um, that are not working. Credits go on out to Synergen Mod um, and the Synergen Team. Synergy and Defy team. Here's your Beta 3 download and your Google Apps. Um, so here, here's all of the stuff that they fixed. They fixed a ton of stuff and improved a lot of things. Um, used, added an SD mounting app. Used this to fix USB storage. Apparently, they added an app. I don't... Um, is that this? I have no... I have I have no idea what the heck this is even a thing for. SSHing. I don't know. Apparently they threw in an app on here to allow us to. Um, oh, USB mass storage. Huh. Okay. I'll show you that, guys. I'll show you that in a second. So, all right. Anyways, here's the install video for the second. Um, one if you guys want to refer to that one but anyways I will show you guys really just quickly how to install this one uh, the the beta 3 so what we're gonna do is pop back up next let's like see what I'm doing alright um, so obviously the first thing you're gonna want to do head back over to the roots wiki and find the download for the beta 3 which is right here or here's the here's the mirror and here's the other one, and then grab the Google Apps version 5.1, uh, and and throw those on the root of your SD card. Um, now, if you're coming from the second uh, beta version of Encounter ICS, you obviously I would I would reinstall the Google Apps just in case. I don't know if you actually have to or not, um, but I would do that just in case. Uh, you what I did was I just wiped. So I'll, I'll show it to you, but the, the the whole gigantic process is not necessarily needed. Um, uh, but to do this, you do need to be on a, a gingerbread ROM point six oh five, preferably. Um, and again, so just first go over here to the Roots Wiki, grab the downloads. S then we're gonna come back over here to our phone, and once those are on the root of the SD card, what we're going to do is. And I'll just show you guys real quickly, just so you know that I'm on the beta 3 version. If you see right there, boom, Encounter ICS beta 3. Yes, I am using a um, Xbox mic, so... Anyways, so there's that. So here's what you're going to do. Once you have that on the root of your SD card, you're going to reboot into recovery. However, by whatever means you, you guys will get into recovery, um, if you're coming from um, MIUI and you have the newer versions, you have the the boot menu, um, it depends, like, like I said, it depends on where you're coming from. You preferably would like to come from a, a, a .605, whether it be stock or whatever, but you, you can come pretty much from any .605 ROM. 
Um, now here's how you're going to be in again to recovery from for the encounter ICS. You're going to wait for there's going to be a little blue light that shows up uh, in the LED section, a little uh, at the top there. And when it shows up, which I will wait for it to do so. There it is. And then we just hit the down volume button. And then this takes us to the boot menu here. Um, and so what we'll do first is we're going to go. So we're going to get into recovery. I'm going to just do that. Come on now. Is this the side or top button? It's the top button. All right. And then latest recovery. And voila. All right. Once you're here in your clockwork recovery, um, the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to scroll down to wipe data factory setting, which is the f third option down. Go ahead and push your um, your red camera button there, and scroll down to yes, delete all user data. I'm obviously not going to do this. I already have. I've already done this, so I'm just going to go back. After that's done, you're going to go down to the fourth option, which is wipe cache partition right there. And again, hit your red camera button, and it will change to and the, the next screen, and it will go down to yes, wipe cache. Now, if you're installing the beta 3 straight um, for the first time, not coming from a previous encounter ICS uh, ROM version, you're going to want to scroll up to advance, which is the one, the second from the bottom, and then hit your red camera button and then wipe Dalvik, which is your second, or Dalvik cache, that's your second option down. Um, and then, hit yes, click on, so click on that, scroll down to yes, wipe Dalvik cache, and then that's done. If you're not, now I, I came from Encounter ICS, uh, the beta 2, uh, and I did not wipe the Dalvik, and I'm okay so far, I haven't had any kind of, any issues so far, so, um, or if there have been any issues, I really haven't noticed anything. So uh, now that once you've done that, you've wiped your data, your cache, and your uh, your Dalvik, you're going to go down to install zip from SD card, and then you're going to hit your red camera button, and then you're going to hit choose zip from SD card, which should be your first option. Um, now you if if you put it on the root of your SD card, which you should have, um, I don't have mine on the root of my SD card. I actually downloaded it straight from the web from the browser here on the Droid X, so it's in my downloads folder. But if so, like for example, see right there, see just above the the highlighted one is the Encounter ISIS Beta 2. If that was the Beta 3, I would go up there, click on it with my red camera button, and then it would go down and it would say, "You click Install I Encounter ISIS Beta 2." Now I'm not going to do that. I'm going to obviously hit back, um, and then. So once that's done installing, you're going to go ahead again, click Choose Zip from SD Card, and then you're going to find the one that's right there just below the, the highlighted one, which is the G Apps, uh, the Gaps version 5.1.zip, and flash that. Once you're done, uh, you can go ahead and reboot your system. And you're just going to give it a second to do its thing. Now the thing that they were the first thing that should come up for you guys when you um, when you boot, which is it's the first thing that came up for me anyways, and I'll show you guys when it when it, it it'll pop up. Um, the app that they added on the on the phone for SD mounting is now uh, it's the it's called UMD Mass Storage or something along those lines. I'll, I'll go ahead and I'll, I'll take a look at it. I actually haven't looked at that. Um, I haven't messed around with that. Apparently it's from the XDA developer's site. But they threw it onto the phone. Um, when it pops up, I'll show you the screen. Um, that normally will show up for you. Okay, there we go. So obviously, you're, so things are going to show up. So there you go, USB mass storage. I'm going to click on this, uh, on this thing here. This is going to be the screen that will show up, that should show up for you when you, when you, um, when you start up, and there will be like the startup droid behind this. Um, so for one day, this is just the um, USB mass storage toggle on um, 
turning itself its auto on you can you can turn it off obviously um, but when you're connected via a USB you'll be able to use this to connect your to mount your SD card um, obviously when I hit the, the blue joy has failed you cannot enable us UMS without a USB connection so USB mass storage the only way the way to get out of this just obviously just hit the back button and then pff, voila you're back to your screen um, now there is a mod out for this that will like, allow you to um, put the little the the ICS buttons on the bottom of the of the thing the three the three buttons the home buttons the back button and then the recent apps button I have yet to do that I, I did it on my last beta version but I didn't do it for this one just because I don't remember where I put the file I'm just going to download it again and, and, and throw it back on there but anyways there you go guys there's the ICS uh, encounter ICS beta 3 uh, how to install that so that you guys can go ahead and throw that up on there uh, if you have any other questions, again, head on over to the Roots Wiki. Um, there is a discussion thread up, and as well as the um, there's a bugs forum that you guys can can go ahead and uh, comment in. As well, if you guys have any questions for me uh, in regards to the stuff that I do or anything regards to this video, please go ahead and comment down below uh, if you would like to. And I really appreciate that you guys do go ahead and click the subscribe button just above the video just to um, get my my channel up and running what this channel normally is it's supposed to be StarCraft 2 casting and analy uh, analysis um, but I do a couple of these videos because this is also something that I am interested in the the uh, the droid scene so um, I'll continue to do more videos on encounter ICS and other uh, other things that show up for the droid X uh, or for any other phones that I'm, I'm currently owning so uh, I appreciate it if you guys go ahead and subscribe, like the video, all that fun stuff. So thank you guys, really appreciate it, and uh, we'll catch you guys in the next video.